Here we are now sitting with you in the audience. You do not understand that a catastrophe is happening now at every second, nanosecond, fraction of a second. And when you follow the pyrotechnics on the contact line of the Russian-Ukrainian conflict, you are greatly deceiving, because the main catastrophe today is a man-made catastrophe of the whole world. It's like this man-made disaster, it's spreading. This is also a Chinese virus that was lost from a test tube in the Wuhan laboratory. These are bastard electric scooters that do not allow decent people to live, which should be completely banned and generally planted. And to imprison those officials who generally allowed this vile thing a priori. But artificial intelligence in today's situation, as it all develops, it already comes out even as a more dangerous phenomenon than Islamist terrorism. I would equate the use of artificial intelligence today with terrorism in general, because this thing is uncontrollable, because it replaces a person. And so I published research very serious university research where they tried whether artificial intelligence could create poisons, poisons and chemical weapons. You know, he could. Not just could, he created several tens of thousands at a time in a few minutes. Combinations that can now be created within a few hours and distributed within a few seconds. Now we don't know, but in these seconds it happens. Artificial intelligence substitutes, not something that replaces knowledge. Poor idiots, school children and students are incompetent. They are trying to use it for teaching, for research, for deceiving teachers. That is, we will soon have neither doctors, nor physicists, nor chemists. There won't be anyone, simply because they will cheat the education system. But not only that, first of all, artificial intelligence is a substitution of a person and getting out of control. Because he can control weapons, power plants, create weapons, push people, push cars, stop businesses, start businesses, break a dam. Absolutely, absolutely any wrecking, military activity of any kind. This is a disaster. This is a disaster and everyone is talking about it. Even the owners of all sorts of it technologies are talking about it, says Elon Musk. The biggest bigwigs of this business and Gates are talking about it. They all warn about it. Even they have already caught on, but it's already too late. Artificial intelligence to be banned everywhere immediately. Immediately. So it's necessary to shout, run to parliament and forbid, and that all special services work only on catching Gopnik, who are so idiots that they spread it. That's what we should be doing now. The worst thing right now is that artificial intelligence is already coming out on top. The world ambitions of China, terrible China, Islamist terrorism, savages means in Europe, and in the USA, and in Russia, from the bottom of the map that came, occupation by savages. And only after that, many, many after that, there is a terrible, monstrous, deadly, yes, but familiar to world history local Russian-Ukrainian conflict. And in the first place, as usual, there are these global technogenic problems, religious problems, religious extremism, and then they stood for centuries. Nothing has changed. That is, I repeat that if something is added, the Russian-Ukrainian conflict is added. This does not mean that all other problems are removed, then it gets worse. And you don't have to be fools and listen to propagandists who are trying to focus you, puppeteering, deceiving on one thing. That's on one thing. You have to see the whole picture of the world. Only when you see the whole picture of the world, then you can at least understand something.